Hello ladies, today we're talking about sparkle and shimmer. Not something that should be kept for Christmas or nighttime only. And you know how much I love a bit of shimmer. I am wearing today a top and bottom from Zara. It's something that I've got spanks on underneath because I really don't want to be like that. I need to be like this, I need to clench my bottom, I need something to give me protection at the back. So I'm wearing it back to front and it's got a lovely stretchy bit here which really helps to hold in my tummy. And when I'm doing this kind of look, I was very tired, I had four hours sleep, I need makeup that flatters and this acts already as a bit of makeup because the sequins reflect back on my tired face, bring it to life, so all I need is a bit of BFF. I've got a little bit of Empress on my eyes with some Victory over that lovely goldeny shade to bring out the sort of champagne gold of the sequin. And then I have Sasha on my lips and a lip light on the top, lip topper, um, which is Cecily. And that just adds to the sparkle. You can never have enough sparkle. And then I'm wearing, because this on its own, I could do, but I just felt I was a little bit too Vegas girl. And by putting on the jacket from Stradivarius, what a great cut jacket might not want to go too near a lighter because you might go up in flames it is polyester but the cut is good and when you wear something that's that tight on the leg you kind of want a longer jacket i don't want the jacket to be doing that i quite like the colors that's me but i have three phenomenal ladies that are going to talk us through the sequin choices they have on today well i'm going to talk them through it but anyway first up sarah sarah come on here darling Sarah is a glorious, regular, this morning model, and you can literally wear anything, Sarah. Come out a tiny bit so you can see this lovely light here. But Sarah's got sort of cool dark brown hair and beautiful olive skin, an amazing green eye, and you can wear silver or gold, but I just love the combination here. So on your, for the kind of champagne gold, this is the Nasty Gal, do a twirl actually. This is a Nasty Gal long coat, you remember I had, it's actually 42 pounds. I mean, so much sequin for 42 pounds, there are probably only a few years. I would get it. The thing we did with it, two little tricks, because we discussed this, yes. it kind of fell off the shoulder sometimes. Mm -hmm. yeah. How often do you wear sequins? Not, not, not often not enough. Not. I love the enough on the end, yes. Did today inspire you? Yes, it did. I've got sequins, I'm gonna wear them. Yes. I like to hear in the daytime, celebrate it. Dressing it down, so this is so over the top, we've dressed it down a bit, but we've actually, there's an amazing gun in wardrobe here which went ka-chung, ka-chung, and it sort of sticks the, product, the, the outfit to you, which we can pull off later. But most importantly, we cut off three annoying, rather cheap looking loopholes, and three buttons which were too big to go through the loopholes. So that's what happens when clothing has been really mass, mass made. Sometimes they don't get it right. But with those cut off, don't you put it over to much better? Absolutely, yeah. yeah. Hands much Hands better. better. And this top, there's two brilliant tops like this, River Island. Sometimes, well, every woman in her wardrobe could really benefit from having an incredibly clean top, sleeveless clean top, with a little bit of detail. And, you know, mirrored on your eyes, you've got strength and you've got a bit of mystery and the colours together, you look so gorgeous, Sarah. And then really clean lip, a little Eugenie on the lip. Um, and then I think a Lady J or Vivi on the cheek with some Lady J. And just, you, you must come and do makeup with this. I, I love your, your colouring, so it's wonderful. Really clean um, black trouser, crop black trouser to have in every woman's wardrobe. Next, 18 pounds. You don't have to spend money on black trouser. Do they feel comfortable? Yeah, yeah. they're really good. Stretch. And it's a good stretch. Again, you can do some Pilates press ups in them. And then the shoe, you've got very good toes, so this helps. And you had a pedicure today, thank the Lord. But Nasty Gal, 17 pounds. Look at the side. I mean, that is, look at the perspective here. It's a really cool shoe. Do you like it? Yeah, they're great. They feel comfortable. Because you know, when you do a look like this, you could do, let's do a silver sandal, wouldn't work. You could do, let's do a white trainer, could work. Yeah. This, is, this gives you a bit, doesn't it? Yeah, it so quite, and Sarah's quite a smart dresser, so to do a train with this look, you wouldn't feel so comfortable. No, although I did arrive in trains. You did arrive in trains, but not in a full sequence. And then I like the bag too. All working well, because the bag is a modern black and white stripe, and there's black and white in the outfit, so it goes well. And that's Jasper Conrad for Devon. Lovely to see you. And please, you know, come with us, chat, and have the other chat. Okay, next up in our sequence story, are you yet inspired to wear some sequins? We have got the delightful Georgia. <coughs> Georgia, who actually is a researcher this morning. They never tell me if somebody works this morning, because they want me to treat them like 
they could be a lady who's just come in from an application or they work um, there. And I love it that, you know, like that because they're truly lovely to do that. Can I say, Chariot looks so amazing on your eyes. Can we just look up close, Lulu, at the makeup? You've got, we've got green eyes. Prominent, I mean, you and Sarah have quite a similar colored eye, but when you close your eye, just that chariot used as an eyeliner. It's so, I'm gonna get you some, it's just, it's fantastic. And then a little bit of smokiness underneath, your eyes really pop, a tiny bit of little um, black thin eyeliner, mascara, a few little lashes, and very pretty lip. I think just like a lip glow there in Lila, and then just a bit of on the cheek. I think there's a bit of, I think you've got a bit of um, shoggy on the cheek, but I'm not sure. But gorgeous, so easy to make you up. <laughs> and then let's look at two basic staples. You know when you're looking for the perfect t-shirt and you find it and then you wash it and then it's like what happens to that rags yeah and this company i only discovered today but i can feel the comfort level and the tightness yeah. you know it's kind of pure cotton the shape is fantastic for your hourglass perfect you wear the shape t-shirt yeah it's like your best shape more than a yeah. peanut oh, your yeah. best shape t-shirt okay. it's lavenderhillclothing.com and they specialize in like basics that are well made 26 quid i'd spend that on the t-shirt yeah yeah Secret skirt, how often do you wear a secret skirt? Sorry. First time. First and time. I love it. I'm so empowered. It's great. Empowered. Color. Good work. <laughs> and can I just go from the side because you've got the most amazing tush. And you just, it's like showing off that beautiful shape. You suit a wonderful pencil skirt. And this is from ASOS, 65 pounds. And the shoes, Boho, 22 pounds. How comfortable are they? Do you know what? They are actually quite comfortable because the thick band at the front, is, yeah. it's just, it's not rubbing too much. Yeah. It's good. To buy a really high heel for 25 quid, I would want, I would worry. Yes. But it works. Yeah. And the bag, this is accessorized, but you know what I love about this bag? You know, a bit of the yellow from the sequin we've got texture without being shimmery and i like the texture on the texture of the sequin but it's not shimmer and then a little texture the earring so all together gorgeous thank you so much i'll see you again i know because you're working here all right darling off you go and last up we have got lena come on out lena and lena is german by way of russia or russian yes. by way of germany yes Von von Stuhl. Ich lebe in Brighton. In Brighton, I've been to uh, before. In, uh, I was born in Russia, yeah. and when I was 11, I moved to Germany. East Germany or West? Uh, Dortmund. Dortmund, that's a bit of 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 a Okay, now, that was for the very few German speakers we've got there, but why not? So, um, Lena, I think what's interesting, Lena, is I think some ladies who have a really wonderful boob are scared of secret. Yes. You know, because you're, you're slim, but you're a G-cup. Yes. And so, sometimes it's how do you fit your, your boobs into clothing? That's exactly. my problem. Yeah, yeah. that is. And, and I think... This is, I mean, this is something Chloe and I are going to do twinning. We can see things of twinning. And we're using this dress. And what's beautiful about this dress, which is from Zara, is I think, first of all, it looks like a designer called Alice Temple, which would be, it would be £1,200. Well, 16, actually, 1600 pounds is the average price of my student dresses. And this is £89. Pounds. But it's high neck, and you've got a big boob, but you've got this lovely sleeve. And so the kind of, the, lovely sort of i love the scalloping of the sleeve diminishes the size of your boobs so you don't look like you're in a dress where you should be wearing a v-neck i feel comfortable yeah and i think you don't always want to show your people yeah. yeah there are days when you definitely showed your magnificent figure and then it does come with a black belt but we changed it yeah. for this thinner belt which we kind of like didn't we yes yeah. it looks much better yeah because you have a, a big boob and you have a, a shorter waist so if we did a really wide belt your boobs will look bigger again. Mm -hmm. So by having that thinner belt, it allows your boobs to finish, have room to gain a waist, and then to go to your hip. And the I'm flow learning is better. a lesson for myself. Fantastic, now. good. All right, darling. And then I like the fact it's see-through here. I mean, I could go on and on about stress. It's so great. And then the fast neon uh, shoes. How comfortable are they? They are good. They're okay. okay. They're not brilliant. They really are for the entrance. Yes. and then for taking off wearing your trainers. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you so much. So there you have it, ladies, a little bit of soupçon. Oh, I nearly spat the camera, I'm so sorry. A little soupçon of sequin. But remember, on days you feel shattered, it's the best transformation. You don't even need truly London makeup. You can just look fresh. 
and um, don't keep it just for winter either. Bye!